Well guys, I'm surprised. At the time that I'm recording this, my first video of Gunner Heat PC has hit about 68k viewers and 1.6 likes. I didn't think this video would be put up by the algorithm, but here we are. My name is Fan Fantasy, and I mainly cover tactical shooters and immersive games. In this video, before I show you guys some gameplay, I want to clarify some things from my previous video. First of all, a lot of you viewers have probably played World of Tanks and War Thunder. It's not my intention to compare the two games with GHPC. In fact, I wanted to show you guys what GHPC brings to the tank games and simulation that is quite unique and different. The game is made by a small dev team and it's funded by supporters. The game is different because it focuses a lot on the single player and multiplayer co-op rather than player versus player scenarios. Speaking of scenarios, each mission that is out there right now is scenario based, where there's a situation objectives that you need to complete. Currently, the fictional scenarios are based on the late Cold War with East and West Germany in the 80s. This game has in mind for those who are really into tanks, such as the systems, armament, ammunition, and even the interior of the tanks. So it is more of a simulation but with gameplay mechanics. There is so much potential of this game of becoming the DCS for tanks. A lot of you have also made comments about how the game might be lacking some stuff. And once again, I want to emphasize that this game is still in development and it's not even out in early access on Steam. So things are still work in progress and limited. Once again, my intention of the first video was to really show off the potential of this game and what it can be. And I'm coming from the perspective of someone who's really into tactical genres like Squad, Hell at Loose, and even Arma, where there are vehicles and tanks along with the infantry. And to give you some context, I'm more of a boots on the ground type of player who loves playing tactical shooters. But one day when my friends and I were playing Hell at Loose, we decided that we should play as a three man tank group. And slowly, I found myself really interested and how fascinated by how tanks can be effective on the battlefield when you have a coordinated infantry and support. Just imagine those some units and communities coming together and playing this game while using commands, tactics, and maneuvers to outflank the enemy. Just like DCS, I think it would be pretty cool to see how this game could potentially attract those some units and communities. When I found this game, I thought to myself I could probably learn a thing or two about tanks while having the realistic mechanics of it. So I gave it a go and tried it out. And boy, this game is challenging as someone who doesn't play a lot of tank games. But I really enjoyed the immersive experience. Just listen to the audio and the voice acting of this game. So here I am, trying to become an effective tanker. This game has a free demo that you can download from their website, but you can also unlock the full demo by supporting them on Patreon. And I encourage you guys to try out the game for yourself and experience it and to give them the feedback, especially if you're a veteran tanker. It's a free demo, so why not try it? This game will not be free to play once it's finally out. Make sure to read the guide on the website or just having it on your phone next to you because it's very helpful. I just hope that one day that they can add an in-game tutorial, but that will probably come later. Thank you to those who have given me tips on the last videos, which have been very helpful, and you can read them here as well too. You can also follow me on Instagram where I do a lot of virtual photography of games, such as Gunner Heat PC. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. My name is Fan Fantasy, or you can call me Fan, and I mainly cover tactical shooters in games. I'll see you guys in the next video, and stay blessed. So many of you have commented in my video that I should learn how to use a laser rangefinder, which I finally learned how to use. To use it, you just gotta press E while you're sighting into a tank that you're targeting, and I'll demonstrate how effective it is. I'm also on the M60 tank. Oh, another tip that I was given is that when a commander says there's an enemy tank, you can press spacebar and it'll move your gun to the enemy tank to get into position first. I'm going to start from the left and then make my way to the right. Okay. And fire. 
Okay, if I don't finish him, I'll come back later. Second tank. And fire. I'm gonna do the third tank now. Took a good hit. Fire. Ooh, that's a good hit. Yeah, turn. Okay, fifth tank. Nice. Alright. And that was it. That was the uh, laser rangefinder. Alright, so in this mission I'm going to learn how to snipe tanks while they're moving. Which I did practice a little bit on the uh, tr training field. Um, but yeah, these are actual live targets that will fire back at us. So we'll see how that goes. Us into a line. Thankfully, we've got better thermals. Can spot them. Gunner, table, tank, convert right. On. Oh. Relay. Fire. On the way. Ah, I see them. Ah, it's really far away. Uh, I have to learn how to leave. Oh, that was a hit. On the way. Oh. A hit. Hit target. Gunner's table tank. Oh. I'm here to fire. Well, short. Target. Re-engage. Oh. Target. Re-engage. Target. Gunner's table tank. Oh. Okay. I'm here to fire. Fire on the way. Target. Gunner's table tank. Re-engage. A little far. Okay, oh. he's gone. On the way. Penetrate it. Lazing my targets. That's best to do that. Target nice. Identified. Oh, you moved. Okay. Not gonna lie, that was quite intense for me. You know, sniping tanks from far away. Not too sure. No. It's it takes practice. You know, it definitely does take practice to get it right as you're lazing them. Gunner, heat, tank! I'm hit him oh. Fire! Fire table! Oh. On the way! Target! Hit. He's looking at us. Oh, nope. Stable up! Black on stable! That was a little far. Oh. On the way! Target! Hit fire! I don't think we're shooting at this. Who's that? Anti tank. Holy oh, crap. Oh. oh. Did not like that sound up. Come on. Got him. Fire! Ah. Re-engage! On the way! 
He's gone. Alright, so the next scenario I'm going to do is called Fog of War. You are a M1 platoon with M113 support. Last night, friendly infantry made contact with the enemy in the town to your front. We lost communication with them early in the morning. You were to assess the situation and support them. Unknown numbers of BRDM2s and dismounts. Friendlies. Mission. Link up with and support friendly forces in the town to your front. Okay. All right, so there's four of us. The town should be up ahead. Okay. I'm the coax him instead. He's hit. Fire, okay. Sure. Heat up. Got the heat ready though. So far so good. I think we have full control of the town just yet. He's upside down. Coming on the right. Beam. Nice. I I can't move because my left track got destroyed. So, mobilize for now. So that was the tank that I was in. His left track got destroyed, so... This guy? I wonder if I have to destroy him. There you go. I don't think he's the last one. Though. guys enjoyed this video uh, if you guys enjoyed it make sure to leave a like and subscribe i'll probably play more of gunner heat pc uh whenever i got more time but yeah so far i've been enjoying it and just learning the mechanics of it um of course this game is still in development so just make sure to check them out and support them see you guys on the next video